So here is another fountain of, an, of a different height. I spoke about the relationship between pressure and height uh, a few, a couple of moments ago. And I decided to come to the second one uh, just to talk about uh, the interrelationship between pressure and height. Uh, I was talking about that when, when pressure is high, uh, the height also is high. So uh, it, it simply means that the amount of pressure you place on yourself, especially over time, determines the amount of flow rate you would have, which would in turn lead to the height you would get, and it would in turn lead to the impact you will be able to gather uh, in life. So it's always a good thing. It's easy for people to tell you, ah, don't kill yourself, don't mount pressure on yourself. Uh, this thing, uh, life is not hard, life is not this. But I, I need you to understand that you have to get uncomfortable. You can't afford to be comfortable with simpleness. You can't afford to get comfortable with just ease or just making things happen the easy way out. The easy way out turns out to be the hardest way out. Shortcut turns out to be a long cut. So I'm urging you today, I'm not saying you should be hustling. I am saying you should strive to position yourself for greatness. And what I'm saying is the pressure you're mounting on yourself is to position you for greatness is to position you for greatness. So the pressure, I'm saying, must require some focus, some degree of, on, well, it's not some degree, a good degree of understanding, a, an excellent level of teachability, mentorship, coaching. You see, those who play soccer beside the road, they don't really need a coach, but if you would play in the great leagues, you must get a coach, you must have a coach. So all these are critical factors. You must do this with a lot of regimented, regulated life, and you must do this with a lot of expectation on yourself, degree of excellence, continuously increasing expectation of yourself, and challenging yourself to fight and become more. So I just tried to use this water as an example so that you would understand that as you're seeing it, if we increase the pressure of this water now, the pressure goes higher, and the height in which the water reaches gets higher, the volume of water flow rate, that's the volume per unit time of water that comes out increases. And trust me, the impact and the flow in this canal also increases. So life is about the amount of discipline, battle reading, pressure that you put on yourself. It is good to be internally motivated because if you wait on life to motivate you, it may be too late. I wish you an excellent 2022. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year in advance. I'm Dr. Kola Oli Joshua. I'm a transforming minds evangelist. I'm passionate about global leadership, strategic innovation and performance excellence. But I also have a very soft spot for individual leadership. And that's why I'm doing this. I know the integral of the individual, the strength of our leadership as an individual happens to integrate together to give us the global leadership I'm talking about. Thank you so much for listening. Bye for now.